Alhamdulillah, by the sheer grace of Allah the Almighty, Jasa Salana Tanzania was held successful at Kitonga Dar es Salaam in Khilafat Hall from 30th September to 2nd October 2022. The Jasa Salana was accompanied by several preparation and events to publicize it through the media so that it can achieve its effectiveness in the prepared area as well. And the theme of this year's Jasa Salana was Khilafat. The three days of Jasa Salana were inaugurated by recitation of the Holy Quran and poem. <laughs> Whereby the Amir and missionary in Chai Tanzania, Malana Tahir Mahmoud Chaudhry Sahib, read the special message from Hadat Khalifa Tul Masi, Ayadahullah Ta'ala bin Nasir Aziz. May Allah bless your Yalsa with great success, and may all those participating gain immense spiritual blessings. May they increase in knowledge and understanding of our religion, Islam, and may they advance and progress in faith. And they led the silent prayers. Upon the arrival of official guest Honorable George Simbachawene, Minister of State, Prime Minister's Office, Police, Parliament, and Coordination, who came to represent the Prime Minister of Tanzania, who's supposed to be the guest of Hana for this Jasa Salana. After going through various parts of important places of Jasa Salana, the flag raising ceremony was held, whereby the Jamaat flag was hosted by the Amir and missionary in charge, and the national flag was hosted the Honorable Minister, which marked the starting of Jasa Salana schedule. Afterwards, the Honorable Minister got an opportunity to address the congregation. Kaulimbio hi inangu kubwa. Upendo kwa wote bila chuki kwa yote. Nineno kubwa lenye thamani kubwa. Na wenzetu mnajitahidi kuliishi hili. Na ndiyo mana na sura tofauti hata kwa muonekano wa kawaida the second day after the recitation of the holy quran and an old poem hamdu sana usiko jozat jagdani ham sar The schedule went on by inviting the speeches such as Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, his example of steadfast faith in Allah in time of trouble and turmoil. Khilafat comes from Allah its blessings and our destiny, unit and peace for the nation, and other faith-inspiring speeches given by missionaries and Jamaat office bearers. Honorable Member of Parliament of Mafia Island paid a visit to the event and was given an opportunity to speak in front of attendees. The speeches on work and its blessings the need of establishing a strong bond with the Khilafat were delivered and the invited guests from neighboring countries, Uganda and Kenya, got an opportunity to express their views about the Jasa. The final day witnessed the ranges of heart-inspiring programs. Speeches were delivered on various important topics such as family life, the direction of obedience to the system of Khilafat, and the responsibilities of office bearers. Invited guests from government and other spiritual and academical sectors graced the event as well. The rewards giving ceremony was held whereby the students who got good position or completed their studies in different levels were rewarded. 
the normal Ba'in also were given chance to express their experiences and how they got to join the Jamaat Ahmadiyyat. The conclusion address was given by Amir and missionary in Church Tanzania, whereby he presented once again the special message of Huzur Anwar Ayyadahullah Ta'ala bin Nasir Aziz, and he gave a bunch of advice to the members who attended the Jalsa Salana. The Jalsa Salana was attended by 3,400 people from across the country. The Jasa Salana was concluded by the silent prayers led by Amir and missionary in charge Sahib. Reporting from Amrabadi Studios, Tanzania, MTA News.